Hi, this is Yolanda Van Veen, and in this segment, we're going to learn all about the begonia grandis. It's a beautiful begonia from China and southern Japan. So the begonia grandis is found all through China and into southern Japan and some of Southeast Asia. So it can handle a lot more cold temperatures than other begonias. It can go all the way down to zone 7. So it's a great, great begonia to have in your garden because it'll survive even colder winters. It is a low bushy plant with red stems and they grow about two feet tall. And they have broad, somewhat fleshy leaves that are pale green and flushed coppery red on the undersides. They're just a beautiful multi-dimensional leaf too. They're really gorgeous in the garden. And then they have beautiful fragrant pink flowers that are about one inch across and they produce in nodding clusters all summer long. So you can trim the flowers as they die back and they'll keep producing more flowers. And the flowers kind of hang down so they look very different than other begonias. And they don't even really look related. So there are tuberous begonias. So when you start your grandest begonias, just start them after the last chance of frost and let them bloom all summer long. And then if you live in a colder zone than zone seven, bring them in. If you live in zone seven and above, you can leave them outside year round and just cut the greenery off as it turns brown. It'll grow again the next year. You can always put them in a container, leave them in the garage, or just leave the bulbs dry for the winter as well. Very easy plant.